Hello friends, today we are going to discuss about working of Institutional Animal Ethics Committee. Now what is IAEC? Let's see. IAEC or Institutional Animal Ethics Committee is a body comprising of a group of person and these are registered by the committee for the purpose of control and supervision of experiments on animal that is CPCACA and perform in an establishment. So every establishment is working on the animal experiment should have IAEC and that IAEC should be registered under the CPCACA. Now, as per the CPCACA rule 1998, every establishment involved with handling the animal, laboratory animal is required to register under the CPCAC. Now why IAC is required or what is the need of IAC? Because in animal experimentation, there are repetition of study and there is no watch on this study. So IAC will take care of all these things. Number of animal use every year is huge in case of the research. Some experiments are carried out only for the sake of the degree or publication purposes. And majority of these animals feels distress during the experiment. So ethical handling of the animals are important. And many are euthanized after their uses. So to take care of all these things, IAEC are constituted in the establishment. Now there are certain goals of IAC. First is to review and approve the research project. Second is to prevent unnecessary suffering to animals during experimentation. Then proper accommodation or veterinary care to the animal is required. Then human disposal after termination of the study. Then mid-term termination if unnecessary suffering is observed in the animal and adequately skilled personnel to do the experiments. So uh, the IAC will take care of all these uh, points. Then what are the objectives of IAC? The objective of IAC are the experiments on animals are avoided whenever it is possible to do so. If there is an alternative uh, methods are available, then animal experimentation should be avoided. If performed, then under supervision of qualified personnel and with due care of humanity. If animal experiments is performed, it required a skilled personnel. Then experiments on large animals are avoided when it is possible to achieve the same result by experiments upon small laboratory animals then experiments are not performed merely for the purpose of a manual skill animal intended for the performance of experiments are properly looked after both before and after the experiments then suitable records are maintained with respect to experiments performed on animals so these are the objective then what are the function of the IAC? Now IAC will review and approve all types of research proposal involving small animal experimentation before the start of the study. For experimentation on large animal, the case is required to be forwarded to CPCSA in prescribed manner with recommendation of IAC. IAC is required to monitor the research throughout the study and after completion of study through periodic report and visit to animal house and laboratory where the experiments are conducted. The committee has to ensure compliance with all regulatory requirements, applicable rules, guidelines and law. Now, make sure in IAC the committee review all animal usage protocol. In addition, the committee ensure that the use of animal is necessary to answer a specific research question. 
a search for alternative to pain and distress is conducted and that pain and distress experienced by the animal is minimized all the laws and policies for the use of laboratory animals are followed including environmental safety the committee also ensure the human care of animals through the inspection of animal housing and use facilities and by investigating any complaints made regards animal use the committee is also responsible for reporting any instances of non compliance and recommending corrective action the suggestions given by the committee is to increasing research on alternatives if alternatives are available appropriate legislation then develop mechanism for checking human treatment to animals then editorial responsibility then ethical discussion in mainstream scientific literature then teaching ethics to of animal experimentation at every level training course for different personnel adequate funds for animal houses detailed guideline for animal house care and supervision now iic is comp composition of iic is that it consists of the cpc constitute the iic on receipt of five names the so five names will be given by the establishment additional four names from outside the institute then iic duration is for 5 years after every 5 years it will be renewed it required to reconstitute at the time of the renewal now what is the composition within the institute or within the establishment a biological scientist one biological scientist is required one veterinary science or veterinarian for care of animals are required two scientists from different biological disciplines are required and one bi biological scientist is required the chairman of the committee and member secretary would be nominated by the institute now four members are proposed by the cpcsa and that includes one main nominee whose presence is must during the uh, during the meeting another is link nominee in absence of main nominee link nominee can attend the meeting then scientist from outside the institute and socially aware member so overall five, nine members are required for the iic now for the quorum requirement are as follows minimum 6 members including cpcsc nominee are required to compose a quorum all decision should be taken in meeting and not by circulation of project proposal presence of cpc nominee is must link nominee can attend in case main nominee conveys his unavailability in writing to the chairman iec socially aware member presence is compulsory in case referred to cpcsa at least in two meetings in a calendar years are required socially aware nominee presence is must in discussing large animal projects and his presence is compulsory at least once in a year now conduct of iic the chairman will conduct all meetings of iic the member secretary is responsible for organizing the meeting maintaining the records and communicating with all the concerned a copy of minutes is required to be sent or uploaded online to member secretary cpcsa within 15 days of the meeting otherwise the meeting will not be considered valid then the subject expert is required in the iic the role of subject expert is as follow iic may call upon subject expert who may provide special review of selected research protocol if needed they are required to give their specialized view but do not take part in the decision making process investigator whose proposal are to be discussed can also be called to present their in their case 
to the IIC. Now, decision in IIC. Members will discuss the various issues before arriving at the conscious decision. A member should withdraw from the meeting during the decision procedure concerning an application where a conflict of interest arises and this should be indicated to the chairperson prior to review of the application and record in the minutes. Decision will be made only in meeting where quorum is complete. Only members can make the decision. The expert investigator inventive will only offer their opinions. Decision may be to approve, reject, or revise the proposal. Specific suggestions for modification and reasons for rejection should be given. In case of conditional decision, clear suggestions for revision and the procedure for having the application re-reviewed should be specified. Modified proposals may be reviewed by an exp expedited review through identified members. Procedures for appeal by the researcher should be clearly defined. Thank you for listening. This is the official website of CPCAC. If you need any further information, please go through the website.